Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. My name is Lalit Rao and I thank you for watching this episode of Philosophy Network. Today I am going to speak to you about the Frankfurt School. Frankfurt School refers to the headquarters of critical theory. It was founded at Frankfurt University in 1923 in exile in the United States of America from 1935 to 1953 and revitalized in Frankfurt under Jürgen Habermas who taught there during 1960s and from 1982. Critical theory has been defined as theory which can provide the analytical and ethical foundation needed to uncover the structure of underlying social practices and to reveal the possible distortion of social life embodied in them. The aim of Frankfurt School was to provide a version of Marxism uncontaminated by positivism and materialism. The Frankfurt School was faced both with the degeneration of Soviet Marxism into Stalinism and the failure of communism to inspire the working classes of the West. A number of broad themes belonging to Frankfurt School can be identified. One is that Marxism and psychoanalysis combine in critical analysis. The Frankfurt School emphasized the interlocking role of aesthetics psychoanalysis and popular culture in reinforcing the prevailing western condition of a passive depersonalized acceptance of the status quo system with its commodity fetishism, fascism and nationalism. In Habermas's work Psychoanalysis which seeks freedom from control by repressed forces is a model for emancipation. Habermas's focus on language has produced an interest in systematically distorted communication to be countered by idle speech situations through which all can participate in dialogues. All this is central to the idea of an emancipatory role for critical theory. This leads to a theory of communicative action directed at the cooperative realization of understanding between participants. Lastly, legitimation crisis is an important concept for the analysis of late capitalism. The Frankfurt School was a major influence on the new left and other radical movements of the 1960s. Thank you very much for having watched this video.